Hey y'all, it's the Costume Jeweler. We are in McKinney, Texas, and we're gonna go into this Goodwill I haven't been into for a while, but I have been into it before. We're gonna check out to see if they have anything new, purses and jewelry for resale on YouTube and eBay. So hit that notification bell, click all so you don't miss out on my live buy it nows and auctions of purses and jewelry, as well as these daily videos. Hit that thumbs up button for this video, and if you have not, Please subscribe to my channel and let's go in here and see if we can pack up anything for resale for a profit so this store can be definitely a hit or a mess you just never know we're gonna look at the jewelry if they've got any hopefully they do and purses we will see I don't come in here that often we might even find stuff for the Airbnb that's what I'll always get excited about I fill those wall spaces up with stuff. Look how fun this is. Guess what? Excuse me. You're good. $199. Guess where this is going, guys? It's going to hang on the wall of the Airbnb. Let's get up close and personal with this. I love this wood engraving. I don't know how old that is. It's not definitely not 1337, but it's awesome. And for $1.99, that is going home with CJ for sure. I love that. What is this? You guys know I'm a super big fan of signage. This is Hobby Lobby. $3.99. I like that. I'm not going to get it, but I think it's pretty. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. So that's a keepsake box. I thought those were actually stamps in there. That's so funny. That is hilarious. It's hilarious. I sure thought. I sure thought I had found a little prize. Look at this. Very interesting. I usually don't dig through all of this stuff either. If you've followed me quite a while, I'll just look kind of topically at things and see what there is. Hmm. Kind of like it. Uh-oh. Now you guys know that I've been putting signage in the Airbnb. This doesn't look old, but it's cute. I don't know, should I get that or not? I think so. I mean, I like the artwork on the front. I wish it were old, but it's not, that's okay. We're gonna go ahead and put that in the cart for the Airbnb. We are, we're just gonna do it. I'm not even gonna think about it. Not even going to think about it. I'm not sure if this would be nice hanging up or not out there. I'm going to have to think about that one. That's awful funny. deer painting not deer painting but deer picture a little bit retro there's a lot of signage in here Very interesting artwork in this in this uh, Airbnb. Now look at this right here. So I thought about changing things out at Christmas. Not too much, but just a little. 
What do you guys think about this picture? Do you think I should get that and store that at the Airbnb? It doesn't matter. Oh, it's two dollars and forty-two cents. Do you think I should get that and store it at the Airbnb, and then at Christmas time you can bring out a few, you know, pieces like this? I like that a lot. I think I'm going to do that. And just have a few things that are fun and old looking. I don't know whose legs those were. $6.99 for this. I don't have room for any other pictures, but look how cute that is. And that is signed. Look at that. I don't have any room with a bunny rabbit in it. Out there at the Airbnb. I don't. I sure don't. I do love that picture a lot though. Look at this old, now this table, I wish I had room for it. I don't. Look at this, now this is very well made. Golly. I wish, but I don't. It says as is, and I don't know why, because I don't see anything wrong with it. It's just really a cute purse. I just don't understand why it says as is. Oh, I see now. It's missing a rhinestone there. So I guess we'll pass on it. So like I said, I don't come in here often, but as my adage goes, you never can tell by looking at a store whether or not they're going to have anything good. You just got to go in and look. Ooh. Come on now. Come on now, baby. And you know it, guys. Meet a beautiful black fossil purse great condition guess where that's going key fob and all it's going home with cj this store is pretty big lots of stuff here we're going to look at the what naughty doodads Ready to explore a new also, career direction? Looking for training and tools to advance your career? Succeed at work with this free and interactive training. Simply complete the registration form. Goodwill Industries of Northeast Texas offers many resources Let's see. to help you get started. The resources on our page will help you explore options and prepare for your next job or take the next step in your career. I don't see any purses behind the counter up there. They may put all their purses out here, Franco Sordo. They may put all their purses out here and not put any of other ones behind the counter. Excuse, oh, sorry. Oh, well, we found a fossil, at least. So here is their jewelry section. I can already see that there's not a lot to look at, but then again, you know what? 
that diamond in the rough. They have jewelry bags. Wonder what's in those jewelry bags. So there are three of them. I have done jewelry boxes and bags before. There's actually six. They're $24 each. I'm gonna pass on the jewelry bags. I've thrifted a lot of jewelry since I've traveled up here. What is that thing? We're gonna go over here and prowl around in this little what naughty section is what we're gonna do. See if there's anything we can't live without. I see some resellers, they sell a lot of these great little things like this. I haven't started doing that. I just do purses and jewelry, but I always look. Cause you know, my garage needs things that I'm never gonna use, right? Put everything in my garage, buy tons of purses and jewelry, I need to have a sale. And then my garage catches the brunt of it because I put all those goodies in there and then I don't wanna sell them. I think that might be called a hoarder. I'm not sure. Why don't y'all let me know? I just think it's a purveyor of fine goods. I love this right here. This is nice. We're getting there guys my favorite time of year we're getting there and look at this little guy how much is he 3.99 it's kind of cute I like these, $4.99 each. I like them. No room for them, but I love them. Oh, these are good quality. Look at this. Oh, they're from Steinmart. I thought they were old. $6.99, but they cost $29.99 at Steinmart. Look at those guys, these bookends. This is a very nice candle holder for $3.99. Look how beautiful that is. Candle goes right here, so let me set it up here for you. Look at this. I like that. Here we go, more signage guys, look at that. I'm on the range. I kinda like it, I do, I kinda like it. I think I'm gonna kinda get it. I think I'm gonna get it, maybe. 
I like it. Christmas. Love it. Some thrift stores, they keep it out all year, and then some, I call it Christmas in July, because they'll have lots of Christmas out. Look how pretty this was. Seven dollars, eight dollars for this. Uh oh, it's a sign. I don't know what this is. Nine nine cents. And here's their game section. So I'm gonna look at it real quick too, just to see if there's anything for the Airbnb. I always hope these, that you know, all the pieces are here. But I've got a game closet too. That's funny to me that they would resell that. This is interesting. Face to face, that might be a great game since most people are on their phones. It's from 2013. Who knows? Look at this. I haven't been buying puzzles when I'm out because I was told that nothing aggravates me more than doing a puzzle. Putting it together, missing one piece, which is not funny. But you know what I'm saying. What is this? Hmm. It's kind of cool. But yeah, when I buy these games, I'm just hoping they're all there. And I'm having faith that they are. That was not me. That was not me. I did buy some astronomy books too. For people to use Catopoly. Huh, what is that? That's well, different. What else? Bingo would be fun. Ooh. So Clue, I did buy Clue. I always like Battleship. What is that? Oh, five second roll, I did get that one. Heard it's a great game. Saw this in another store once and I didn't buy it, but I think I'm gonna go ahead and get it. Now this is a crazy puzzle. It's awful different. Yeah, I don't know if it's from Germany or what. $2.99. That might be resellable though. That looks kind of vintage. Okay guys, that's it. Hit that thumbs up for this video. Subscribe to the channel. And hit that notification bell so you know when I post new content. And when I do my next live buy it now. Of purses and jewelry. And on that note, we will see you guys. Wow, where's the salt? Well, you would know that I'd find just a salt shaker, right? Right at the end, just the salt shaker.
Now I would buy these. I would so buy these. Golly. Anyway, on that note, we'll see y'all later. Bye.